guys, it's Vijaya, and in this week's video, I'm going to show you how to make one of my favorite holiday snacks, rosemary candied nuts. And I love this recipe because each nut has this perfect, crispy, sugary coating and gets a great savory note from all the spices that I use. These nuts are perfect during cocktail hour with a nice cocktail or a glass of champagne. But frankly, I like to have it around the house all through the season so that people can, you know, nibble and munch on them as they go around and do their holiday types of things. What sort of holiday types of things do you guys do? But I don't know, I just like having it around the house. It's a really easy recipe. It doesn't take too many ingredients. Here's what you're gonna need. You're gonna need three cups of nuts. You can use whatever nuts that you like. I'm going with a cup of pecans, a cup of almonds, and a cup of cashews. I have a tablespoon of water, half a cup of dark brown sugar, and a quarter of a cup of white sugar. I have a tablespoon of freshly chopped rosemary, a tablespoon of dried mustard powder. I have two teaspoons of chili powder, or cayenne powder, two teaspoons of salt, as well as half a tablespoon of smoked paprika. And this is the secret ingredient here. We're gonna be using an egg white as well. So let's begin. So in goes my water. I'm just gonna separate my egg, so I just want the egg white for this, so be sure to cradle that yolk. Oh, snap. <laughs> oh, there we go. Okay, I saved it, I saved it. You don't want any of that yolk in there. And then I'm just gonna discard it, just use it for something else. And then I'm just gonna take a whisk. Sorry, before I start whisking, I whisk until it gets super frothy. Okay, that looks pretty good. So you just wanna break up that yolk, that's the point of whisking it. Now I'm gonna add my sugars. And we're just gonna give that a nice mix a rooney until they're all well and incorporated. I'm telling you, this recipe is so easy. It's a dump and stir recipe. And you see how frothy and beautiful that becomes so shiny and lustrous? Okay, so now in with my chili powder, my mustard, that fresh rosemary, which is gonna add such an aromatic component to this. My smoked paprika and my salt. And that rosemary has that sort of woodsy note that just reminds me of the holidays. I love it. And this is gonna provide my nuts with the perfect shellac coating, okay? So in go les noix, my nuts. <laughs> okay, and just using a regular old spoon, I'm just gonna coat them nice and evenly. Like, how good do those look already? They look so good. Oh yeah, so get them nice and coated. You want every little bit kissed with that beautiful brown sugar mixture. And now, it's ready for my baking tray. So I have a cookie sheet here that I've just lined with a little bit of parchment paper, and oh, out comes those glorious nuts. Oh, and you can smell the spices already. Just imagine once this heats up and gets nice and toasty. So, every last one, come on, you little bugger. <laughs> okay, and then you just wanna spread it out into one nice, even layer so that they cook nice and evenly in the oven because you want them to cook around the same time. I have my oven preheating to 300 degrees. I'm gonna pop it in for 25 minutes until it gets nice and toasty. So I'll see you in a bit. So when they come out of the oven, they look a little something like this. How amazing and crispy and crunchy are these? And all I did is once they came out of the oven, I just took a spoon and you know, sort of smush them around so that they got nice and coated and then I let them chill so that they could cool down and get nice and crispy. And so now, oh yeah, you see how crunchy those are? They have this beautiful sugary coating. Oh man, what should I try first? Let's see, okay, how about a pecan? You guys think I can eat this pecan? <laughs> That's such a horrible joke. <laughs> Anyhow, let's give it a taste. Mmm. I should put a disclaimer on this video because these are freaking like addictive. <laughs> I'm sorry if you get fat eating these because there's a chance that you might. It's just so, so good. 
You have that perfect candy shell that's so crispy. You have the savory notes from the mustard and the rosemary and, and smoked paprika and the cayenne. Perfect amount of salt. I'm telling you, I could just sit here right now and demolish these. And I hope you try this, that you demolish this too, so we can all be fat together. Because you know, it's not the holidays if we don't wear our stretchy pants and get fat together, <laughs> right you guys? I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please be sure to give it a big ol' thumbs up. You know how that makes me feel. Subscribe to the channel if you're new. And as always, please leave your comments and recommendations and anything else you wanna leave for me down below. Let me know what you'd like to see next week. I love you guys, and I'll see you next time. Bye.